Ooh, this is one of my favorite makeovers, and it only took me a day to do. We bought this MCM dresser from the thrift store for only $30. It was a little bit worn out, but mostly in really good condition still. First, I cleaned it and filled in the few chips and dings with some wood filler. Then I sanded the wood filler down with 220 grit sandpaper. And then I sanded everything else as well, just to give the paint a good surface to stick to. Most of this dresser is wood, but the top was laminate, so I made sure to do an extra, extra good job on that top. Then I cleaned all of the dust off with my shop vac and a tack cloth. I thought it would be nice to leave the drawers wood, so I sanded them down to the bare wood veneer. I had to be careful though, so I didn't sand through the veneer. But I started with 100 grit sandpaper, then moved to 150 grit sandpaper, and then to 220 grit sandpaper. Moving through the different grits of sandpaper helps avoid those nasty swirl marks sanders can leave behind. Look at how pretty that wood is now. It was well worth the four hours of sanding. Then I cleaned off all of the dust and sprayed three thin coats of Minwax's fast drying oil-based polyurethane onto them. While those were drying, I set up my little paint booth in my garage and primed the dresser. I like using shellac based primers the best because they block bleed through stains and they have excellent adhesion. This one was Bin shellac based primer. I don't love how much texture the rollers leave behind though, so once the two coats of primer were dry, I sanded the primer smooth. Then I put the paint in the paint sprayer and painted the first coat of paint. This paint is General Finishes Enduro Poly in Black. It's a pretty thin paint, so it doesn't need to be thinned out and it really can only be sprayed. It's way too thin to brush on. It dries fast in about an hour, so it goes pretty fast. I like to lightly sand between coats with 400 grit sandpaper to get the smoothest feeling finish but it's not really necessary. The next day, I put the drawers back in the dresser and here is what it looks like now. This makeover was pretty straightforward and was so fast compared to a lot of my other makeovers. I love the natural wood mixed with the black. What do you think? I'll catch you next week for another three minute makeover video.